Davey, we put a message out, a message on social media asking for any questions that anyone might have. And I get to put them to you. Um, Budding23 has asked, how many goals is Saka getting this year? And could he be Arsenal's top scorer? Um, I hope he's not Arsenal's top scorer, but there's every chance that he could be. Um, you know, the quality of his goal on at the weekend was amazing. How many goals? I would say. <laughs> How many goals? I think anything from ten. Uh, no, ten to fifteen <laughs> is a great return from him. But I, if I'm honest, I hope he's not our top scorer because I want our striker to be top scorer. Do you think any of your strikers are capable of getting twenty twenty five plus? No. Not at the moment, no. Um, because you know, with Havertz and then Jesus, um, I think they'll they'll share that out a little bit between them. Uh, hopefully, um, I don't think we've got like um, you know, like an out and out goal scorer. If you know what I mean? You know, plus Saka's on penalties, isn't he? So yeah, his his tally, his total might go up a little bit through that. You know, it's always good when your strikers on the penalties because you know, as we've seen with Harry Kane, you know, how many how many penalties does he score? Um, but yeah, I'd, I'd rather it be be spread out a little bit more. But Saka's got off to an amazing start. So follow up question to that then from AJ Jassy nineteen ninety, who asks, "Do Arsenal need a new striker? Do Arsenal need a new striker? Um, I want to say yeah, just because of um, you know the 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 situation with Jesus and his and his injury." You know, I think it's two operations he's had now. You know, I know one was just to clear up or whatever it was. I don't know whether it's the whether it's a different knee or not. Um, but that's a little bit of a worry, you know. And then with Havertz, he's not an out and out striker, if you know what I mean. He seems to get in, involved in the play. Um, so would it be a good signing? Yeah. Will it, do I think they'll do they'll do it? I don't think so because I think they're struggling at the moment with the FFP, with the financial fair play. Um, so, yeah, I, w- I would like them to, obviously, to get an out-and-out goal scorer, but I don't think it'll happen. Do you think there's many out there? No, because there's, you know, you've, you've we've just let one go to Germany. How good <laughs> yeah. would that have been? <laughs> I would have took you all day long, no matter what, you know. But no, I think just I think that could have had more reaction than when Sol Campbell left to come to Arsenal. <laughs> just slightly, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, you know, but um, yeah, there's there's not there's not many. Yeah. If you want to put your questions to David, they don't all have to be Arsenal. Follow us on social media at Seaman Podcast. <laughs> Maybe nothing about Southampton this year, because obviously they're not in Premier League. But everybody else is teams. Come at <laughs> us. The other ninety-one teams in the English league. Yeah. <laughs> not biting. <laughs> <laughs>